The goal of this video is to help new players in Hattrick make a simple training plan. So the goals here are to have a simple plan, of course, to have a sense of progression, because if you train keepers, you, you can only train two players a week. They will raise in skill a lot. You will see a lot of pops and it'll give you a sense of progression. As long as we train keepers, we have a lot of flexibility to experiment and trying out formations. But keep in mind, this is only an inspiration. You could also set off with better or more expensive talents. This is just an inspiration. But if you are unsure of what to do, I would recommend just sticking to what you see in this plan. So the tool we're looking at right now is HT Cycle, developed by Session, and he's been using the formula by Shum. It's an excellent tool, and the reason why we use this tool and not the built-in training planner in Hattrick is because this tool is not behind a paywall. So with this tool, you can basically make an entire plan for a player's training throughout his career if you want, if you wanted to do that, and then you would be able to see how all the different training periods would affect his skill set accumulated over time. So bear in mind, the first few examples here are very simple and we will jump right into an, an example with one season's worth of keeper training. Right, let's have a look at a goalkeeper and how he will turn out after one season seasons of training. We'll call this uh, player goalkeeper and we will write 17 and 3 days. We will have a keeper at level 6 passable and we will leave him at inadequate defending level 5. The remaining skills will just set to 1. Chances are we might get a little extra set pieces once we start looking to buy a trainee but uh, for now let's just leave it like this. All right, so one season is equal to 16 weeks of training. So we'll, we will enter 16 weeks here and we'll pick the keeper skill. Stamina, we will always leave stamina at 10 as long as we are training for the maximum skill improvement in our trainees. And that is usually what you do at the age of 17. So we will set this to 10%. We will aim as a newly started team, most likely to get a solid coach as soon as possible. So we will set this to solid even though we might have a week or two with passable training. It won't matter much right now. So let's just set it at solid. And we push the train button. All right. So after nearly a, a year's worth of training, that is dependent on the actual uh, training updates when it occurs, you can always adjust it here if you want to be very precise in your cycle calculations. But it tells us that the chemo would reach a skill level of the 11.2. That would be brilliant. It should be possible to acquire such a player for 50k, 50,000 euros, and you should be able to sell him for around 2 to 2.5 million after season's worth of training. And that's the goal here. It is to create a simple training plan for a newly started team to generate some funding and being able to start working with more sophisticated and advanced training plans. But in order to, to demonstrate this tool, let me just let me just adjust this plan a little. This is not the original plan, but uh, let's just say we want to train the keeper for two seasons and afterwards 32 weeks of training we would also want to train him for a season in defense now i've added two periods and then i'll then i push the train and then you see that he would be 14.2 keeper and 8.75 defending if we train him this way now if we scroll down a little we would be able to see all of the pops and when he was expected to pop in the skills here we have the overview of 32 weeks of training Kiba, and you would see that it would take three weeks uh, to uh, gain the first level to solid, then only two to excellent, three, then four, and then you slowly start seeing the week per level increasing. At some point, if you were to train keepers in the long term, it would be feasible to start training him in defending over keeper. 
but that's a more advanced training plan and that's that's not something we would discuss here but all in all you can see all the different expected improvements in skill over the course of his training plan another important thing in the bottom here is the estimated wages of said player during his career and as you can see he will slowly but surely get more expensive as he increases in skill let me just remind you one more time that the final bit here is just an example and we are only looking to train our keeper one season 16 weeks all right so in order to make a short summary of uh, the course of action for a simple trainer keeper plan it is to buy two goalkeeping trainees for an approximate value of 15 50 000 euros each for a total of 100 000 euros and then we train them 16 weeks one keeper in the league match and one keeper in a weekly friendly after 16 weeks we sell them for approximately 2 million euros each and in the end of the first season we should have made a profit of approximately 3.9 million euros it could be less it could be more could we earn more training something else most likely but this is what i recommend if you are completely new to hattrick remember one thing always 100 percent training intensity and um, always 10 percent stamina for the very young trainees last thing i want to say is thanks for watching and thanks to session and shum for the formulas but especially to session for making this uh, awesome tool to all the new managers starting out in hattrick good luck it's a very fun game once you get started and you start to learn the more detailed things of hattrick good luck and have fun